Okay, this is granite part two. We're actually going to see them how they took from the dry fit stage. Now they've got it all propped up and they're putting their epoxy adhesive down very quickly. And they'll do dollops of it. Immediately went and looked my face too. Yeah. <laughs> way you broke the camera. So most people don't get to see this operation. They just come in and see it all done. But one thing you, you can see here too is, is if you look at the sink, it's got all the holes pre-cut into the cast iron. So our holes for our faucet and soap dispenser and all that, they're predetermined where they're going to go. But we certainly won't use all the holes, but we have the option of using one, two, three, four, five, six, seven holes. But we will all only use three. About ready to drop this down. This is what we call the nervous piece because it's the biggest one and it's got the sinkhole cut into it. You've got to think of granite as a big piece of glass until it's laying flat down on its surface. Very fragile. Believe me, this isn't going anywhere once this is done. The secondary purpose too for putting the globs is, is that if the counter wasn't perfectly level, which I'm sure they run into that on occasion, not with us because our cabinets are dead level, but they can use that to kind of level the top a little bit, say within an eighth inch or maybe even as much as a quarter inch. So when they're all done, that countertop is, is exactly level. <laughs> Sound. That means we were successful. <laughs> okay, thanks for tuning in. We'll stop and do another one later on. See ya. <laughs>